Hey everybody, this is Bill in Alaska. Um, this is not the video I intended to put out today. This is just a quick heads up to let you guys know that the video I was going to put out today, which is my, today's my 100 day on carnivore. Um, and I had a couple things planned, but it's getting postponed until tomorrow at least. Uh, hopefully I can get it out tomorrow. But a couple things came up today that are, uh, this kind of knocked me for a loop a little bit and I, my brain's a little scrambled eggs. Um, just super quick. Uh, a lot of, you know, that the symptoms I was having, I talked about in my last video, I was supposed to go in our, uh, my nurses wanted me to go into the clinic and get ultrasound and x-ray. Uh, but I decided just to take a bunch of uh, vitamins and fast for the week and, and see how things turned out. Um, it may have helped a tiny bit, but I, all my symptoms are still there pretty strong. Uh, anyway, at 6.30 this morning, I had a text. I had just woke up. Daisy woke me up. And I got a text from Carrie like 30 seconds later right after I woke up. And he's like, he's like, Bill, I need to talk to you ASAP. It's urgent. And he never left me a text like that before. It scared me. I was, And I initially thought like, oh, my goodness, one of his family members or something got hurt. Um but it turned out to still be a pretty serious text. Apparently, Dr. Shafee saw my last video talking about my symptoms, about the uh, sore shoulder I've had for the better part of a year, and uh, and then the body numbness that from my chest down that I've had for the last month. And he's like, uh, he told Carrie, he's like, he's like, dude, you get in, you need to get hold of Bill and let him know he needs to get into the hospital immediately. He's like, today, immediately. He's like, don't wait. Um, he needs an MRI. He doesn't need an X-ray uh, or an ultrasound. He says, those will be useless. He needs an MRI. Um, and he's talking, you know, the nerve damage that I'm experiencing now could become permanent. Or it could get worse. I could become paralyzed. It's the sobering, scaring, scary stuff. So anyway, I'm right in the middle of trying to work that out. Uh, find a place that can has an MRI machine that can hold someone my size um so anyway I'm, I'm right in the middle of that so I'm like well I guess I'm just not in the right mind to do my video today I'll get that out tomorrow um and let you guys know more um the, my clinic that I go to is closed on the weekends but I'm trying to get a hold of my nurse and trying to find a place where we can get an MRI done immediately uh, or immediately as in uh you know like for tomorrow hopefully you know right away um so anyway <laughs> i'm sorry to dump this on you guys i just uh trying to scramble and some figure things out and how to get into town right away it's you know if dr shafee didn't text carrie to get a hold of me right away i was going to go another week with just fasting i wasn't going to go in you know me being me i was just going to hold off and uh, see if the fasting, long-term fasting, you know, a couple weeks, and just taking those vitamins, and hopefully would start showing improvement. But um, when a neurosurgeon like Dr. Shafee says, hey, you need to get in ASAP or that nerve damage, you know, potentially become permanent, uh, you know, you listen. So I'm going to get in right away, and we're trying to figure that out right now. So um, everything is going to be fine. I, uh, it's all in the hands of our father in heaven, whatever happens, good or bad, it's going to be all right. It's just, uh, I'm going to have a little apprehension to be honest. And, uh, now I feel a real strong urge to get in ASAP and to figure out how to get in there right away. So I will let you guys know, uh, hopefully tomorrow what's going on with me and, uh, and then we'll go from there. So this is just a quick heads up. I will have a fuller, uh, more information, hopefully tomorrow. Um, maybe the next day, but I'll, tr I'll try to make it tomorrow. I know a lot of you guys are worried. I thank you sincerely for your prayers. They, they mean so much. Um, prayers really, uh, they really are powerful. Uh, so I will talk to you guys hopefully tomorrow, and I will give you an update of exactly what's going on. And in the meantime, as always, be kind to one another, um, repent, and get right with the Lord because 
you never know uh, what's going to happen day after day, especially in the world that we live in right now. You know, just a, yesterday, I wouldn't think that I'd be where I'm at now. I thought, well, you know, I'll just uh, I'll just fast and um, we'll see what happens in a week. And then, boom, here I am, you know. Uh, so I'll talk to you guys some, hopefully tomorrow and let you know what's up. I love you guys and uh, we'll see you soon. Thank you.